from Super. That's the round of Congratulations. Congratulations. Did you feel any pressure? Did you feel nervous? I don't think I performed well today, actually. I don't know, you actually won the second set with Lee Knock, but I ended up losing it. Uh, this is the game where he lost his three colossi. Right. And yeah. my mentality went down after this. Definitely had an advantage that game. It was PvP, so the build was really important, and I wanted to actually have the better builder. I wanted to win the battle of the builds, basically, you know, get that advantage early on. Uh, in the America round game, you actually crush the four seals with your Colossus. I went into the Nexus a lot faster than my opponent. So he knew that he had uh, the timing to actually go over there with those extra minerals and, and uh, that advantage he had to push through. Basically saying you're really good, he said thanks. Ah, and your last set, you went all the way up to 500 APM. Wow. He says he feels like his heartbeat went really high as well. I don't know if it was 500 beats per minute, but getting close. Um, just really happy he was able to defend when he saw that proxy. That's how he defended with that fast APM. That heartbeat was racing, but he still did it. Well, why'd you go, uh, you're even go high, he's like, well, it's not really for anything specific, but it was just micro, you know? Yeah. He's clicking a lot with his micro. It was like too much. Yeah. 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 So, how are your thoughts going to renovate well? I haven't really been performing that well today, specifically. Uh, but in the future, he's going to be trying to show some better matches. And I'll be practicing very, very hard for the upcoming matches in the round of eight. His goal is to go to the finals and win the whole thing. Wow. It'd be crazy if Super made it. This is a, he really went through the trial today, the he ultimate did. trial. He went all the way. Playing all three matchups. Let's let's recap this. Do this, man. Terminator beats Fantasy, then Leenok beats Super. So. We have that starting things off. Leenok playing incredibly well, then beats Terminator. And Advance is playing two P uh, ZBPs. He played so well, uh, he didn't have any trouble in the group. Then you look at uh, Super, he's able to beat Fancy in a tough, tough match that went to game three as well. And then in the final, final match, he had to defend crazy all in. You know, he tried to proxy and failed, still was able to recover. I mean, he played all three matchups, playing what a day, man! The PVZ at first, losing it, then winning both a PVT and then a PVP. Fantastic work from uh, the winners today. There were some really interesting games, and uh, yeah, I definitely my favorite was Gleenock versus Super. Very action packed, very back and forth. You know, I feel like Fancy just has a few tweaks to making his plays looking really good these days. He looks fantastic. I just, I, I'd love to see a little bit more variation in his build, uh, build orders more than anything else. I think you know, a lot of these Brood War Terrans love to just be robotic, man. They just Ter definitely have that robotic mindset. I mean, looking at innovation and flash and those guys, they yeah. all like to just work at what they know. I feel sad that Terminator lost by trying to do an all-in that failed. I feel like when that happens, I mean, well, he was doing it. It's his own fault. Previous game as well, man. Quote unquote, right? But I, I hate to see a player go out like that. It just always feels like you didn't really get to see their full potential. Yeah. But our match for next week, you and Valdez will be cast on this one. We got Stats versus Classic and Life versus Hero in Group oh, B. Oh man, your favorite group, right? That's my favorite group. Unless it becomes all PVP, and then maybe not. But. It's so long as life is still in there, mixing things up, it should be a lot of fun to watch. Well, for you guys, uh, 
I'm going to be going on vacation for a few weeks, so I'm going to be gone. Yep. You guys hold down the fort well without me. We'll take I'll good be care of it, mate. Don't you worry. And uh, we'll definitely be enjoying watching all those games. I'll be staying up late like the old days back when I lived in Atlanta. I had to wake up at 6 a.m. for GSL. Yep. Still bought subs, even though I had very little money. But, um, <laughs> well said. But guess what, guys? If you don't want to uh, buy subs, first of all, you should do it because you want to support Korean StarCraft 2, especially at the SSL. It's uh, pretty cheap. And also, you can get source quality source if you subscribe. Quality. Yeah, man, it looks sexy. Still pretty high quality if you don't. Here are our next Pro League matches, by the way, which you should also subscribe to and follow the channel for. It's going to be MVP versus Samsung on the 19th, and CJ Entis versus Jin Air. Can't wait for those entries to come out tomorrow. The lineups will be released. They should be a lot of fun, too. MVP versus Samsung should be really close, and then CJ and Jin Air are looking on top of the world right now. Yeah, that's just going to be a, a colossal fight, man. No, it's going to be really interesting to see the lineups tomorrow. It's like so sick that CJ Antis and Jenner is the second match as well. Just feel like you build up the tension to that moment. Yeah, dude. No, it's going to be a great week next week. Though I'm going to miss you, man. I'm going to miss you, too. We'll have to stay in touch, play some games Oh, cacao together. you, man. We'll play some Counter-Strike. Yeah. We'll have a good time. That we will. All right, guys. It's been a great day of the SSL here. Thanks to Neighbor for sponsoring this awesome tournament. And I'll see you guys when I get back. But until then, have a great night. And we'll see you guys next week here on this, uh, you know, this stream at this studio for Pro League. I'm Proxy Wolf on Twitter. He's Moonglade AU. Have a great night.